Happy St. Patrick's Day. Don't be like me and make sure to wear some green. Hi, my name is Donovan and I work for the Pope's Prayer Network. As we all know, St. Patrick's Day is a day of great celebration, but it's not just about leprechauns and rainbows. Born in 387 in Roman Britain, St. Patrick's life was one of listening to God's signs, being brave, and showing his creativity. At the age of 14, St. Patrick was taken a slave by Irish pirates. During his time of six years there, he worked various jobs and finally escaped around the age of 20. After being back home, he felt a call to the priesthood, and after some time and studies, he became a bishop in 432. And then after some more time, he started to feel another call from God, and that was to go back to Ireland and help evangelize the people who enslaved him. He did this by showing bravery and creativity, such as using the shamrock as a way to explain the Holy Trinity. He eventually died in Ireland in 461 AD. St. Patrick leaves a great legacy with us all today, and we're all thankful for the sacrifices he made. St. Patrick, pray for us.